now let's start off by showing you my hands before they are so dry they are so rough looking and just need a little tlc we're gonna lighten brighten we're gonna get rid of the dryness the roughness we're gonna get rid of the wrinkles so i like to take this mixture and i like to be generous with it place it in the palms of my hands and then i exfoliate i basically play with this on my hands i'm exfoliating the palm i'm exfoliating the knuckles i'm exfoliating my cuticles i am just exfoliating and it feels really really good on my hands if you are out there with dry rough looking hands and you're looking for a fast solution this one is for you this is going to transform my hands in the space of three to four minutes that's how long i use it on my hands for and you can also take it up on your hands i exfoliate exfoliate don't be too quick to stop exfoliating you want to do this for about three minutes or so and focus on the areas that is extremely dry like in between your hands just the way i'm showing you and once that is done then i am gonna rinse this off it feels so good that you might just want to continue but definitely rinse off so go ahead and rinse off and that's what i'm gonna do right now see i told you it's like i don't want to stop because it feels so good on my hands now once i rinse off take a look take a look amazing brighter clearer looking hands and you can follow up with your hand moisturizer or take a few drops of any of your favorite oil and massage it on your hands and you're good to go use this at least once per week and you're on your way to gorgeous looking hands now let's share the recipe my first ingredient is going to be oatmeal and oatmeal contains exfoliating properties it also contains absorbing properties the granules from the oatmeal will have to exfoliate your hands so i am going to be using about a quarter cup of oatmeal what i'm going to do i'm going to blend it to a powder so go ahead and blend or if you have a grinder go ahead and grind now let's pour this in a small bowl and we're going to set this aside and work on the other ingredient my next ingredient is going to be banana so whenever you find yourself with these overripe banana do not throw them out because they make a great an exfoliator banana contains skin brightening properties and most of the skin brightening properties you're going to find in the peel of the banana so i'm going to peel my banana and uh, there it is and once it is peeled then i'm going to reach for my blender you can choose to chop the banana or you can choose to break it like i am showing here place it in the blender now once that is done i'm going to reach for the banana peel and what i'm going to do i'm going to take my knife and i'm going to scrape the inner part of the banana peel this is where you're going to find most of the skin brightening properties so i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to scrape once that is done and i'm just going to place it in the blender along with the banana flesh so go ahead and place this in now that we have our banana what we're gonna do we are gonna blend blend to a creamy consistency after blending your banana take a look this is it so now we're gonna reach back for the oatmeal we're gonna pour it in the blender with the banana and yes I suggest you blend the banana first and then you add the oatmeal next I'm gonna reach for some baking soda and we're using the baking soda for its exfoliating properties the granules from the baking soda is gonna to help to lighten brighten get rid of the dead skin cell get rid of the flakiness on your eyes very very great for this recipe so one teaspoon of the baking soda add this if you do not have baking soda go ahead and add some white sugar or even some brown sugar to the recipe 
Next, we're going to reach for some oil, and my first oil is going to be some grapeseed oil, a light oil that's going to hydrate the skin, and we're going to pour about a teaspoon of the grapeseed oil in. My next oil is going to be some aloe vera oil. This is the oil that will help to get rid of pigmentation. It's an oil that will soften your hands, and when mixed with the banana and the rest of the ingredients, it's just going to leave your hands so smooth and soft. I'm going to add some liquid to this, and I'm going to be using using some rose water rose water have to balance the natural pH levels of the skin if you do not have rose water use regular water or here's a little tip for you you can use some brew green tea you can use coffee or you can even use milk to replace the rose water so once this is done we're gonna blend all the ingredients together just blend it up to a creamy consistency and take a look this is what it looks like after it has been blended and now guys let's pour this out let's pour this out i can't wait to use this on my hands and now once that is done it is ready you're going to use it to exfoliate your hands like we showed you in the beginning two to three minutes or so exfoliate exfoliate at least once per week you need this and here is another little tip for you this is also good to exfoliate your feet if you have dry cracked heels Take it down on your feet and exfoliate. And when you're done, you rinse off, use your moisturizer, and you're good to go. A quick and easy solution for dry hands, rough looking hands. You're looking for younger hands. You're looking for brighter looking hands. Just go ahead and try this remedy. And there you have it. Thank you so much for watching. You like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to try the recipe. And one more thing, guys, we have our skincare line, and this you can find on alexmaxi.com. I'll place the link right here. Uh, visit our website and shop for some of our skincare products, especially our facial polishes that you can use on your face and also on your hands. We also give you a silicon brush with these polishes so you can try, you can use them to exfoliate the skin, not only your face and your hands, but your entire body. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.